Today marks an important day from nursing to business, education, sciences, humanities, and arts. It is an opportunity to celebrate your achievements and the hard work across a range of disciplines. Even as we salute you today, our newly minted graduates, this moment is built on centuries old commitment, one that is uniquely Felician. You are here today because you have dedicated yourself to excellence, to applying yourselves, and to being faithful. You have lived our Franciscan values of respect for human dignity, compassion, transformation, solidarity with those in need, and justice and peace. You have worked hard and you have left Felician a better place. Taking on the world may seem really daunting right now. You should know that it seems that way to every graduate at every college and university the day after commencement. But today I'm hoping to shadow any fear you may have and ignite a spark. A spark that not only seeks opportunity, but creates it. A spark that motivates you to overcome the fear you have of becoming a leader and a spark that helps you see that it is all of our responsibility to make our world a better place. You have worked hard, made many sacrifices, and this is yet another wall you have climbed in life's journey. You deserve to feel proud, and everyone in the center today is immensely proud of you. So today, as you're about to open the door to the next stage in your life, I challenge you to seek it, envision it, innovate it, create it, but grab hold of it, because there are immense opportunities in front of you. The question is, are you ready to continue this journey on the, to find the right road to your happiness? The hard work doesn't end today. Today is proof that hard work has great benefits. The fact is, while we're here today, we're all blessed to live in the greatest country in the world. Our democracy has been tested in recent years. And while I believe our democracy will endure those tests, it will only do so if good people with caring hearts and sound minds continue to nurture it and protect it. Remember what Sister Martin said to me, good people and important places. Eliminating the discourse we see today will require a new generation of leaders that will respect differences of opinion and acknowledge that we can in fact disagree respectfully. So it's time to lead on my young friends. It's time to paint your picture. It's time to change the world and make it a better place. Are you ready? Come on, are you ready? Then let's go. <laughs>